Hi, this is Rob here from createonlinebusiness.com. I'm just going to walk through the very simple steps in installing Google Analytics on your website. So this is the website we're going to start with. You can see that I've just actually put this website up. It's new and I want to monitor the traffic that's coming to this website. So I'm going to use, this is Firefox by the way, I'm going to do a control T which opens a new tab. And let's go to Google Analytics to start with. This is the page that you will see to sign up on. If you do not have an account, you just click down here. In my case, I do have an account, and I'm going to sign in with my Open ID. You can see that I have a few accounts here already, and I'm going to add another one today. So basically what you're seeing it with these websites, first of all, is they're organized in what Google Analytics calls profiles. And that's essentially how we're going to set up every website in this account. So let's add a website profile. To add a new website profile, we'll click the radio button on the left-hand side. Now I'm just going to go back to my other tab and we'll copy the URL back to the Analytics tab paste, remove the HTTP colon slash slash, and continue. That's simple. The account is now made. and We can scroll down and we'll get the new tracking code. Make a copy of that. Now to install the Google Analytics code on your website, you're going to need an HTML editor and my favorite is Dreamweaver. This website, as I said, was recently built, so let's go into the recently created Includes folder. And on this website, I only have a few pages, but I'm using two footer Includes. And essentially what's happening here is these files are being included in every file that displays publicly on the Internet. And I'll give you an example here. We can open up the index file, scroll down to the very bottom, have a look, and in the code view above we can see that this is including the includes sidefooter.php file. So I actually know that I have two of them, and that includes now every single website, or sorry, every single page on this website. So let's open these two footer files which are on every web page. I'm just going to open them. right down here at the bottom I'm going to paste in the Erkin code or the Google Analytics tracking code we just copied from their website. Let's go to the other S-side footer file, same thing again, let's just paste it in. Now I'm going to connect to my server with the connect icon and let's upload those two files to the server and that's pretty well it. We, we are done. This code is officially installed. Let's see if we can go back now and have a look. Well, let's go to the website. I'm just going to click the refresh button. We'll do a right mouse click. We'll view the page source. Here's the page source. We should at the very bottom see the Google Analytics tracking code. And there we are. So as of this minute in time, we are tracking with Google Analytics. This is Robert Kennedy from Create Online Business signing off.